Hey everyone, I hope you're having a great day. Um, I just wanted to hop on here and talk about just education in general. And a lot of the, the things that I'm talking about are are what's going on here in the state of Nevada in Las Vegas CCSD but I'm sure it happens in other school districts as well but I just wanted to hop on here and say that we really have to stop blaming each other um, in the there's a group that I'm in on Facebook that talks about what's going wrong with our district and it talks about how <clears throat> administrators aren't supporting teachers and when teachers um, didn't get their font their raises that administrators didn't care and then when administrators got it um, and all this stuff it's like a lot of a lot of the blame game and then also like with the deans deans being eliminated and now they're, they're they're talking about turning them into school safety instructors or something to that effect and there's teachers talking about like how this is wrong and the deans never supported us why should we why should we report support them and i just want to i i want to see us get out of the blame game and it's kind of it's natural for human well i've seen that people just blame each other it's like we're always looking for somebody to blame and point our finger at but education's never going to change until we stop blaming each other because at the end of the day at least i'd like to think so that most of us if not all of us are making decisions because we truly believe it's in the best interest of teachers administrators and students and we're not seeing it that way when it's on the other side of the fence we're thinking like oh they just did that because of xyz or they just did that for xyz when when we're blaming each other it makes it even harder to come together to come up with a creative solution because when the other side comes up with a creative solution you know you're almost not even receptive to it because there's all this hate to build up um regarding the other side so i just feel like we all need to put it down and come together to come up with solutions because at this point we have to get creative and we have to do something different than what we've tried in the past because it's not working. It's not working. Things are getting worse. We're having um, kids that are not reading and writing in high school. We also have like more and more police officers in high schools, which is really scary because schools with more police officers tend to have more arrests. So we're just becoming very reactive. We're not trying to get proactive. So that's what I would like to see get more proactive and coming together to make positive change for our kids because we owe it to them. We owe it to them. So that's all I have to say today. Um, please let me know in the comments, like what would you like to see changed? Um, what do you think would be a good first step for everybody? Um, I think it is, it's just a, a matter of sitting down and having a conversation, but um, what would you like to see? So I'd love to hear from you in the comments and let me know if you're an educator, are you a parent and what your thoughts are. So I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you tomorrow.